Yeah, well, I think the ducks are finished screwing. They're duck fuck fest. Although it looks like some of the um, migratory flock is still here. So I don't know, maybe they're just um, shopping for sloppy seconds or, um, you know, who knows what's in it. In a duck's mind. I keep inviting Howard to come quack on YouTube, but you know, well, no, 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 <clears throat> nobody wants to make videos with me anymore. Certainly not the dogs. Well, we all know what Kitty did. Just started um, screwing around with the mouse and almost got me kicked off Dana Larson's um, Facebook site for attached to Sensible BC. He's he's the dude that runs it. He's um he's the glue between. Uh, well, I don't know, I guess, uh, I guess Miss May and the Green Party is still pretty iffy on it. That'll be Jody Emery's, uh, department to <clears throat> try and glue the provincial Green, BC provincial Green Party together with, uh, we at the back of the bus. We prosecuted and persecuted medicinal marijuana users and really that that does include the uh, recreational users that don't use it for some sort of therapy or another in lieu of soma gas I mean it turns out all the uh, fluoride that they're gassing into the water supply uh, you know wasn't quite the soma we had all been promised by 1984 and you know That, that clown with the button nose there, uh, the ray gun guy and his drug wars, well, they, they failed to pacify us for our social outrage and, and personal uh, inflicted and infliction atrocities and whatnot that, that we seek so much to medicate ourselves from some of us. And, it's not just used for serious physical problems like uh, Crohn's or all the other GMO food digestive diseases or, or uh, chemotherapy poisoning, uh, which is really along the same track. With ganja you can eat with uh, the proper Rick Simpson's oil, the fungi-induced and cultured tumorous cancers well I'll just say again Rick Simpson soil maybe someday that <clears throat> that editor will come and put a link down there and when she's not dying her hair or whatever and um, <clears throat> and you'll be able to click on there and go right to uh, to uh, seek herbal remedy in the playlist over there, assuming I haven't been evaporated out of the uh, Googleplex so far. So do you like that double sky or what? Of course, you're only getting that reflectivity because of the uh, the minerals and metals in uh, in uh, covert uranium semi-desert duck pond. Or whatever the hell we're calling it in this episode. Hey, small problems, eh? I mean, you gotta you gotta expect and deal and adapt with these when you're terraforming a new Earth. Uh, if you don't mind me gluing the episodes together, so um, so I call upon you all. I seem to be extremely shitty at winning um, seed money from the lotto. No matter how diligent I am. I have to excuse me. I'll pass my later. Want to be a guest star, Cindy? And get that fucking thing out of my face, I told you. You might want to get evenly raped by... Uh, the central scrutinizer at Google Flex, but we dogs aren't into that kind of thing. 
Well. Okay, so now I had it here. Let's fork this up. Okay, there we are. Too many pockets, eh? That's that's curse of the broken monkey rancher. Solar Sentinel spaceship mechanic or whatever. Hey, sweetie. Still struggling with Cindy's eye infection. But we'll get it. Just need a batch of, well, Rick Simpson's oil actually. It seems to be effective. There's that when I treat her, it'll be the uh, fifth dog in the area. And it, it certainly appears to be a uh, fungal weakening, which is probably a result of uh, digging in the uh, triuranium octioxide, or uranium oxide, if you want to you know, shorten that and be a little less specific that uh, is mixed in the ground because I had been, well, I had been trying to grow all kinds of gra wild grasses and shit in my little uh, one acre lease spot and it'll leach out given the nature of the store and soil and it'll end up back in the aquifer eventually but and good news, good news somebody sent me fifty dollars and said buy a gift so I'm going to buy them a water test because, hey guys, it appears. Right, be right back again with the dogs. Come on, guys, you gotta stay over here. I know you're not in the movies anymore, but. I still have many sorties to complete, and several missions and a couple of campaigns that have to be done. Right? Can't walk out on your investment and then bitch. When you're combined resources with partners, right, Google? Or I mean YouTube. I never did click on okay. I had to sit up YouTube it for almost 60 days. And wait for them to put a screen on that didn't require me to arrest me to okay into <clears throat> combining my YouTube agreements with Googleplex. I know most of you fucked yourselves over and <clears throat> became their product. As in your character, your image, they have rights, right? Like I said, you die, well then they'll just make more of you on the screen. Gotta read the fine print. And if you don't got time for that, I always Type above the OK box before you click it upon my solicitor's approval. Or signed under duress, do not understand, which means you don't come under their authority. Given the misappropriation of the language, the letter of the law, common target criminal. Hey! So, <clears throat> See if we can get you some ducks. So, I was about, um, I need 50 mil. And the closest honest way of getting that um, fast would be, well, be uh, um, Lotto Super 7 or whatever it's called. Um, so, if you want to, um, Donate your uh, your number pick between one and forty nine. Yeah, and um, I'll recombine those in some magnificent um, conglomeration of calculus, and um, well, we'll give that a try to randomize and scramble the uh, central scrutinizer uh, lotto Ponzi scheme computer that 
fixes who wins and who doesn't. And well, you know, you, you, you know, use your imagination, right? <laughs> um, I see the boys at Lotto BC are looking to lead the way, though. They're they're thinking, oh, direct taxation. Fuck, man, that that sure would go in with a forum democracy in Canada. We can start that at the BC level if we wanted with a policy. Oh. I'll have that editor when she gets here put the uh, put the link in right there <sighs> to uh, the directed taxation playlist where one of them is one or two of them is talking about fixing the lotto up into what it was meant to be when it was you know the Roman Catholic Church saying well can we have a bingo then to support our hall well we're just doing that with directed taxation so uh, let's um get back to the main theme so why I need you to donate your guess at what between 1 and 49 uh, the 50 million is uh, to go well at least 49 million of it um, would be uh, going right into uh, joining the Americans and uh, Going on the next step on finishing off this 99.99% complete um, Pan American Highway and joining the Americas, right? And, you know, I'm speaking specifically about the Darien Gap. Blank. Oh no, you can't, you can't do a link here. You have to go down there under more information for Darien Gap or the comments. I'll put it up there. You can learn about the Darien Gap and which is obviously when they failed to, uh, they managed to fuck up the South American economy after, you know, in the 60s and onwards. But uh, they didn't manage to fully capitalize it, on it because um, the people down there are wise enough to uh, say, what? You want to do what? No comprehendo. Um, and they also never quite had, you know, fluoride in their municipal water supplies all over. I guess maybe that's part of the reason. So anyhow, they hadn't been taken and blah, blah, blah. Okay, well, we'll just, we'll just, um, starve the fuckers out and we'll, you know, we'll hire these Condonistas or Sandinistas or whatever or mercs and they'll suck all the locals in after a little bit of terror and shock and awe and, you know, they'll, they'll, they'll guard the Styrian Gap with the life of their very uh, memed uh, beliefs and and make sure that the Americas don't join so the common man can enjoy that emergency escape route and that's the biggie right because that's what I'm about I'm sure you've all read my survival trip being the first meaning of life <sighs> there's the link there as soon as you know the editor gets around to it and um <clears throat> And it also affords the opportunity that uh, to migrate to the person that just needs the adventure to express their 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 their, their migration genetic migration needs or or whatever they just have to get out and diversify and spread their their family line seed, which is I mean how could you deny that that's you know that's freedom of movement. Why? 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 Who? Anyone that would deny that fucking basic right is El Cuckoo. El Cuckoo! To go against the meaning of life. Survival. Theirs or someone else's, which is actually inseparable. Uh, I mean, did anyone tell you different about that mindfully being fruitful and multiplying? I sure didn't hear anyone tell me different. Put it in the comments down there if somebody told you different. And we'll we'll just get to the bottom of this thing that less life is more. I don't know. I just I can't really wrap my head around this created scarcity bullshit and maybe maybe that's a basic precept of, you know, driving your brain insane with terminal greed to try and rationalize why you got you know a thousand or a million or a billion or a trillion 
dead deer piled up over under that hill just so nobody else can have them because they're they might flourish and then they might eat all the deer and then you would have no deer to eat or tacos or you know whatever whatever you eat LJ if you're a whale or a sardines I guess if you're a dolphin or yeah so uh so um if all that's got you convinced um give me your guess down there in the comments and um hopefully uh youtube will actually let me see them without tampering them and um um i've basically saved up again for the last three months and i got five bucks and, and i'm gonna buy another ticket uh no, i'm not like i said if I win the 50 million, 49 million goes into this uh, joining the Americas gig. So that'll be your return on investment for generating a lucky number <clears throat> and contributing. You're not like you're not getting a share of the 59 million or a share of my million. You're getting the same thing everyone else gets: fair and equal treatment to the proceeds, which will be wisely spent. Uh, you know. Yeah, I know. 50 million wouldn't build 100 kilometers of swamp uh, skookum tidal wave survivable superhighway transportation corridor over swamp uh, even if Chinese slaves were making it on on um, stolen resources um, but what it can do is it can fund the alternatives, which right now are just the Air Corridor Cartel. Which has absolutely no use in emergency evacuation or, uh, you know. Joe Peasant Migration trying to survive. So, uh... You want to open it up? You want to be part of it? Well, there's there's a way. Freeway. All you got to do is think. Or, you know, get your cat to punch it out on the computer. And, uh, maybe we'll, 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 we'll see you on... The ferry is going to be the first stage. A green ferry. That takes advantage of all the, uh, All the natural energies down there. Wind, solar. Outfitting some really safe old ferries and um, that alone, you know, once you spring these um, mega global Zionist scams, that New World Order routine where they steal everything and make you and me the tax slave pay for it well as soon as you spring that trap and they see that it's not gonna keep the economies screwed up anymore well they'll scramble to salvage what they can and I would expect that they'll jump right in and <clears throat> try and scam us the uh, tax paying slaves to uh build a proper transportation corridor that's, you know, even much more economical than a ferry, and much freer, and, you know, if you can slither, or crawl, or run, or walk, or ride a bike, well, you you can theoretically cross it. <clears throat> they want, uh, they want to unify the world? Well, fine, it's going to be fair, not just... No, no, that we weren't talking about you goy slaves. You just stay right there in your one acre and, or, or on my plantation or in my factory and you never need to go any more than how far you can walk <clears throat> between work shifts. No, 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 no. If you want an open world, then it's going to be fair and it's going to be for everyone and it's going to be governed by everyone dynamically and based on sound carved in stone fully agreed upon oh boy more dog digging constitutions charters 
whatever else we decide. It will be changeable and there will be no more anonymous changeable voting, no more robocaller, no more fixed <laughs> casino voting machines. All that stuff will just be so obsolete it will fall to the wayside overnight. You just got to um, curb out the, the basics for the working examples. And there will be plenty to try and sabotage it, because that's why leading's not always easy, by example. They'll spend their last dollar sabotaging you, rather than to try and make their scam work. Because that would be to admit that they were wrong. And they have to get out of denial and deal with all that shit in the back of their mind. That conscience that they thought they had gotten rid of. No. Even if, you're, if you're able to function your eyes or your ears or any of your senses, your fingertips and sense, you know, your nerve endings and, 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 and sense what's relaying, then somewhere in there is a conscience and memory function. Okay, and you listen very carefully to what I'm telling you. I'm telling you we to deal, begin dealing with the consequences of your your post-traumatic stresses and all that shit. You need your minds to function, even you social pass. Which includes all of us, because whether you did or didn't do something, Contributed or had taken from you the control, you know, made the slaves were more of a part of the Roman Empire than than the imperial um, in inium or whatever the fuck. So um, I would suggest you work on it very fast because um, well, for all I know, the 199 is here and you got a lot more fucking gold blocks coming. You will change your ways and be glad that they're there to help you because <clears throat> what's coming in nature is going to be a lot more demanding on the change department. And if you don't get your collective together and your independence together, you're going to have a whole lot less adaptability potential as individuals and as a as a society to to meet and survive. And if you do, well, you will be Star Trek kids.